Hey, what's up, guys? This is GTA Gaming here. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to get the duffel bag on any outfit. Is and this is after patch 1.48. Um, so, so what you're supposed to do first is just um, you, uh, well, actually, what you need is you need a terabyte. Uh, you need a terabyte, something that can fly. Um, preferably an oppressor, but you can also use a helicopter. You could use a plane, but that would definitely be harder. And um, you could also use, or and uh, something else you need is uh, you're gonna need access to the job robbery in progress. So what you're gonna want to do first is you're gonna want to uh, go to this right here, the uh, and then you're gonna go to quiet jobs, robbery in progress, and you're gonna start it up. Once you start it up, you're gonna you're gonna want to just pretty much complete the mission. So I'm gonna access the custom computer. This can take some time, this part, this scanning. Sometimes it can take up to like a minute. So. Okay, so this is a specific standard bench. Let's go interior. Okay, and after that, uh, you just gotta go wherever it tells you to go, like depending on where yours was. Okay. These guys look like professionals. So, I'm gonna exit. <clears throat> Alright, uh, I'll see you guys when I'm at the bank. Alright guys, so once you're at the bank, what you're gonna wanna do is, you're gonna wanna just, uh, steal what you need to do. And uh, just go in there. Uh, take this guy out, headshot this guy. And then what you're going to do is come in here, kill this guy and this guy. And then once you do that, you're going to want to go steal the gold. And after that, you're going to come outside. Okay, so um, something I want to explain uh, is that the uh, robbery can happen at several different places. Like for example, there's a fleek down here by the uh, Life Invader, and uh, it's gonna have different places where you're supposed to go. Uh, and uh, the fleek one, for example, is the one by Life Invader. Uh, you're supposed to go to Cypress Flats once you lose the cops. Mine, I'm supposed to go by the beach. So um, you can do this to any one of them. It doesn't matter. I should lose the cops any second here. And then once I do that, um gonna wanna just uh deliver it. In the old method you used to have to land in the circle. Uh not anymore. You can just kinda land and then go in the circle. Doesn't matter. Okay. Um, I'm gonna go in the circle, and then <clears throat> once I do that, I'm gonna go and you're gonna want to make sure uh, you go to ammunition next. This step is really important. I'll see you guys there. All right. So once you're at the uh, ammunition, you're gonna want to go inside. When you come inside, uh, you want to go to the parachutes. Go to parachute bags. And then number 25, the Israel bag. Uh, I, I'm pretty sure I already have it, yeah. Uh, you're going to want to buy that. And just to show you, you're going to want to, uh, you should uh, make it so it shows. And then after that, um, you're going to want to go and you're going to want to go to the beach. And you're going to jump off uh, your presser once you're at the beach. So, like so. And then, if you've done it right so far, when you land, it should, uh, should have a duffel bag on. This is not the end, though. You still have to do something else. 
Yeah, see? And then, do not save it yet. It, it won't work if you save it now. You need to do one more thing. So once you do that, you're going to want to um, head to the mask shop. Or, not head to the mask shop, just uh, go back into the beach and get pretty high up and hover. And once you do that, once you get high enough up, like, I think... I like to get pretty high for this one because um, it can be hard to... Uh, the animation might take a bit long when you're jumping off. So I like to just go higher and then pull your chute. You have to be precise about this. Uh, you got to make sure you land right at the mask shop. You, uh, what I like to do is I like to just hit the stands. So, because you're going to want to, uh, when you land, when you uh, when you get to the ground, you want to press, you want to spam right on the D-pad. Once you do that, you're going to want to save this outfit. I'll save it as just to say uh, RP7 Duffel Bag. Or just Duffel, actually. And once that's done, uh, what you should have is. And then there you go, there you have it. There's a Duffel Bag. And something else you can do is if uh, this will, I believe, this will freeze your outfit. So if you don't want that to happen, you can either kill yourself from the interaction menu or you can just blow yourself up. Or you can uh, go to um, uh, either an MC uh, or a CEO and go to manage MC and MC style or uh, CEO style and then that and then everything should be unfrozen. You can shoot your outfit now. So there you have it. That's all for the duffel bag glitch. Um, be sure to check out uh, King Panda. Uh, he's the one who showed me this method. And I'll have his link in the description. Um, if you like this video, be sure to subscribe because I make videos like this a lot. And also, uh, subscribe to King Panda. He makes videos like this as well. Uh, with that being said, uh, that's all for this glitch. Uh, have a nice one. Hey, what's up, guys? This is GGA Gamer here. And today, for this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to put on a mask, glasses, and hat at the same time. So, you're going to need a hat, mask, and glasses, uh, obviously. And. Uh, what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to head to the pier or your apartment anywhere there's a telescope really. Uh, I prefer the pier. It's easier just because it's more open of a space. So put on any mask you want. Uh, let's say I just want to do the balaclava. And what I'm gonna do next is I'm gonna uh, run towards the telescope and spam right on the D-pad. So even though you've done it right when it takes off your mask and it has you face towards the telescope. So once you do that, you're going to want to put on uh, any glasses you want. And then uh, and then you can also put on like a hat. Uh, I like to do sort of the ball of color, like a black cap because it matches. So once you leave the telescope, after you've done that, it should put it on. And that's how you do it, guys. Um, if you like this glitch, uh, be sure to check out my other videos. I post uh, glitches kind of like this. Uh, thanks for watching.